Bible. What is it? That is the story of Adam and Eve. The story we're going to be telling today. The story starts off like this. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Hmm. And the grass and the water and the fish and the trees and the animals and the fish and the grass. He created everything. He also created the first man. His name was Adam. And also the first woman, Eve. That's later in the story. Wait, that is... Oopsies. Anyway, Adam and God have some fun together, but God realizes that Adam needs a friend. So God puts Adam to sleep and takes out one of Adam's ribs. Oh, ribs. Ribs, ribs, ribs. Yum, yum, not yum. now, but not, we're telling the story. Fine. He takes out one of Adam's ribs and... He uses it to create Eve, the first woman. After he creates Eve, Adam and Eve have some fun together. They play around in the garden. They eat some fruit. But after a while of just having fun naming the animals, like Bob, Jerry, Larry, Jeff, Hippopotamus, Hippos. Any you know? Aardvarks? A penguin. Hmm. Penguins are nice. <laughs> After they named the animals, God gave them one rule they had to follow. So, Bunna, do you know what that one rule was? Yeah. Don't eat the fruit from the middle tree. Because <laughs> the fruits from the middle tree will kill you and you'll never have pizza again it's scary you'll be dead <laughs> vanquish you won't be breathing <laughs> you won't be able to eat pizza wait you won't be able to have ribs you will be no more you'll probably explode Whoa. You breathe no mass. <laughs> That's scary. You will die. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I don't want to die. <laughs> but they listened for a little while until the snake comes walking up. Snakes don't walk. It was probably more like, but it did something and just came up and it convinced, a I mean, Eve to eat the apple. And after Eve ate some of the apple, she handed it to Adam. He took Don't eat it, Adam. He took Don't eat it. He took another bite of the apple. God was not happy, and for some reason, Adam and Eve found out that they were naked. What? What? Yeah. That's gross. So what did we learn about it? Well, we learned to not talk to snakes while you're naked. No, we learned that you should always trust God, no matter what. Because his rules are to protect you. And because he loves you very much. Now that we can eat apples again, what are the rules God has for us? Well, no cheating, no saying bad words, being nice to everyone. Hmm. Those sound like good rules. We need to listen and obey. Thanks for listening to our story. We'll see you Sunday. Sunday. Bye.